I built a cat post from scratch. And she loves it. This video is a vlog of the creation process. Look, Look at how enticing this is. Oh. 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 <laughs> Yes! A climber! A climber! Yes! <laughs> it works! Well, there's not a lot of room in my room, but I have to make a cat post. So, let's do it. My hair is getting long, too long been forever since I've worn a hat but uh, I haven't built something in a while and I don't have that many tools I'm probably just gonna be using a hammer and nails I got that box of 18 by 18 inch carpet tile at Lowe's for $20 and figured it was better to build a post for her myself rather than spend $40 plus on one from the store so, I grabbed some scrap wood and started cleaning them up. Here I'm making a cap to hold the holes together. Here I'm thinking of how to make it more sturdy and further connect the two boards. Scratch that. I will cut small chunks off of this long piece and fasten it in sections. It's coming together. Feels feels kind of tough. Got the got the end cap on, and uh, yeah, it's kind of making like a little little ladder thing, just a square block. Getting you dusty. What I'm gonna do here is janky get out but it's gonna work so I'm gonna put this into the bottom of this maybe this way and then I'm gonna use this and go straight into the into the platform it's about four feet should be should be good put some glue on it So, with my gluey fingers, and land those freaking pricks in there. Well, this is definitely more stable now, coming in at the side with one of the stair step things, and then just doing that. So there's four nails here going this way, and then five nails going this way. I used a lot because my first attempt would not have been strong enough. Now, for the fun part. Just cut out the centerpiece. Just use a whole piece for the base, because why not? Okay, we got uh, a rough base, and there you have it, 
I used uh, three tiles. Here is my four foot cat post. Um, just use nails to fasten it. You can see them scattered throughout, but it's good enough to hold it. And it feels pretty sturdy. Um, except, I mean, the corners are a little wobbly, but that's whatever. And you can see I took a, took a box knife and I just cut out as I was going with the carpet seam. I just cut out those little wooden steps um, cause it was easier. It made the, it made it look a little nicer. I mean, it's janky kind of already, but it looks a little nicer with those being out and it gives, gives the cat something else to kind of mess with. It's whatever. Oh, maybe I'll add this to it. <sighs> yeah. Princess. Princess. Hi. You want to come down here for a minute? Look what I made you. I got a got a big tall post for you. I wonder if you'll be able to get to the top here. She did not understand its Ugh, purpose until I would add that. some extra things to it later. Look at that. Look. See? She'll get it. Eventually. So because she likes the string that pulleys my bed frame, I figured I could get some to entice her to the post. And it worked immediately. I also tied a mouse toy to the top of it so that she would bat at it and have multiple reasons to be attracted to the post. My work was successful. She uses it every day. Thanks for watching.